Hi, I'm Steve Gill with your Daily Notes video for Wednesday, September 26, 2012. Well, the media's been talking a lot lately about Mitt Romney's tax returns. He's now released his 2011 tax return, which reveals that he paid at a 14.1% rate. Now, the Democrats have been quick to jump on this and point out that that's lower than what some people pay if they're making $50,000 a year. And that's accurate if you're counting people who had to include their adjusted gross income and their payroll taxes and all the other taxes that might be included in that. But when it comes just to the federal income, tax rate, the Tax Foundation has discovered that Mitt Romney actually pays more than 97% of Americans. The effective federal income tax rate for somebody making between fifty dollars and $75,000 a year is actually about 7.8%. That's the federal income tax rate. And this makes sense when you consider that about half of America pays zero federal income taxes. Now, again, they may have Social Security taxes. They may have payroll taxes. They may have state and local taxes. But when it comes to the federal income tax rate, half of America pays zero. That doesn't even include all the people who get something for nothing, actually getting tax money back when they don't pay anything at all. That's even kind of a complete redistribution of wealth, which President Obama says he supports. The bottom line is that Mitt Romney's federal income tax rate at 14 percent is higher than 97 percent of what Americans pay. And yet Barack Obama and the Democrats are claiming that he doesn't pay his fair share. And let's not forget the other 30 percent of his income that Mitt Romney and his family gave to charity last year alone. He gave 30 percent of his income to charity. 14% of his income went to taxes, meaning he paid about 44% of his total income to taxes or gave it away to charity, meaning that he didn't really keep all that much of what he himself earned. And yeah, he did earn that. Joe Biden, on the other hand, contributed 1.5% of his income to charity. You heard me right, 1.5%. Isn't it interesting that we've got so many liberal Democrats that talk about generosity when it comes to taxpayer money, but when it comes to their own money, they're skinflints. They don't give anything away to charity. Joe Biden's a prime example. That's it for the Daily Notes today. Check back later and we'll have more with the Steve Gill Show.